Well, it looks like we got pumpkin and spice over here. Spice is a black and white kitty on the left, a real sweet cat. She was trapped on the uh, Ole Miss campus and thought to be feral, but is not at all feral. She's really quite sweet. And on the right is Pumpkin. Pumpkin's a sweet boy. We've had him for a while. He was very skittish when we first got him, but he's actually gotten to be quite sweet. And so we're hoping to adopt Pumpkin out to a uh, barn with benefits, if you will. We'd like to find somebody that needs a good barn cat, but is willing to give the cat a little bit of attention, too and take care of them, not just their food and their medical needs, but give them a little loving too. He could definitely be a house cat for somebody that was patient and didn't, uh, wasn't looking for a lap cat. He loves to be kind of left on his own devices and you can pet him a bit, but he's, uh, he doesn't like to be picked up too much. And he's, I don't see him as being a lap cat, but he's a real sweet boy. He'd make an awesome mouser. Actually, his usual roommate is over here taking a nap. This is Valley, and he's kind of like Pumpkin. He's a he's a sweet fella, and he likes petting. I don't know if you can hear him purring, um, but I don't really see him as being lap cat material, and uh, he doesn't like to be picked up too much. Uh, both Valley and Pumpkin would make good pets for somebody that wasn't looking for a lap cat, or somebody that's looking for a barn cat, sort of a barn cat with benefits. Because uh, they're not skittish like we usually think about barn cats being. And that noise you hear, that's Dot vying for attention. He's licking on my arm trying to get me to pet him. As you can see, both of these boys get along real well with everybody. Dot, you're just a mess. What am I going to do with you? Okay, okay, I'll pet you. You'll just do anything for attention, won't you? Yes, you will. There you go.